Hello, ladies and gents. I am the Rev. We are back with more of Lost Ark. And I think hopefully we're away from all of the various uh, make you spend money, burn up in game time stuff for a little bit. Hope we'll be able to keep with the story here. Abandoned birthplace. So, Nahum's birthplace. Ooh, it's a dungeon. Legendary mage and architect. But it's not really because it doesn't have the. Uh, you know, easy or hard thing, so. Alright. So. Archer suck. <laughs> okay. Any more of his crappy little army floating around? Must be. That's his kid, all right. Yeah. Whoa! Yeah. Hold on a second, dude. Yeah. I didn't quite do that. What was what? All right, let's have some fun. Yeah. No, you are not. Revenge is mine. Come here, dude. Come find my little area here. Father, you ain't shit, son. Hey, where you going, bitch? Get you for this. The hell? Several knights of Lutera have come to protect the king's tomb with me. Imbued with my clay soldiers, their souls will last the ages by my side. We must protect the glorious king of Lutera and the power of Genesis that he has taken on. One day, when the song of the hero rings throughout the land, the legend shall be reborn. What are you gonna make, like a giant statue? Kinda what it looks like. Yeah, arm, legs, torso, head, all that she's out. The sun bows down. The king's resting place. Mage relic, what was that? Interesting. All right, we'll just swap that out. Works. Okay, now we're supposed to go. Hmm. 
Hmm, something tells me we gotta, we gotta leave. Then this stuff will pop, I think. Alrighty, let's see. Okay. Glory be upon Lutera. This is the Termia Library. Please keep it. You found the clues. Nahoon's clay soldiers. What a unique way to leave one's trace. The clay soldier is mentioned in this biography. The sun worshippers, the king's resting place. The king's resting place must mean a king's tomb, right? Perhaps Therene knows which one. Knowledge is well. Oh, we gotta go back to the main palace. Okay. Now they really got us going back and forth here with the fetch quests. Damn. I'll salute the knight. Oh, that's wrong one. Our descendants will honor you. Run blindly. A similar verse. I remember someone singing it when I was young. Oh right, back then Odin was the court musician. He's retired now and living on some bright hill. Why don't you ask him about that line? The farmers in Duer Plain should be able to give you directions to Sunbright Hill. We're just getting started. Let me guess. So yeah, we gotta go back to the Decor Plain. Man, that's an awful lot of running around crap. It's all good though. What the power of editing is for. Remember to activate your triport. It will help you get around Mutera. Alright, so we went back to the Monterey Manor. I think it's going to be the fastest way to get... Ah, there we go. Go to the other tripart. Pard? Tripart? Whatever they call it. There we go, and she's nice and close now. Really? Get this off. Come here, puppy. Hello. Fine weather we're having, huh? Where are you headed? You're going to Sunbright Hill. Oh dear, there are rumors going around about that place. The exploited farmers apparently revolted. You know what? Good for them. Anyway, you can reach it by taking the road straight down from the station. Stay safe. Okay. You get a car to some court. You said you were going uh, to the oh, Pumpkin Village. Okay. Pump mess at all. Kingdom. A friend of mine lives in the village there, and I'm not sure even have enough food. 
Got some porridge. Could you take? Oh, God. Sure. Why not? I get free stuff for it. It's on the way. Where are we heading out? That way. Okay. What's the porridge for? It's for Mila. Ah, oh, she does like to help. Thanks. They say the world uh, harvest the other right. village on fire. Uh, A pox on them. Uh, now we're on old Sunbright Hill. Ooh, those things again, huh? A funky looking. La, la. Mm. Let, Let me see. see. Ah, this song is quite old. I think I've seen similar uh, lyrics before. Do you see the Nehemn Observatory over there? The text on the plaque there looks quite similar to the lyrics you're talking about. Anyone can use the observatory with the horn of Valor Ludus, so go take a look. The magic and boot in the ancient creature's horn is the sound of power for the observatory. Have you learned magic from the Sevillians? Nahoon was adept at architecture by magic as well. How are we supposed to do that? Open these things? Oh, you gotta kill four, huh? pick up the pace a little bit not quite hit all the side missions at this point Ooh, what tells me yeah those things are gonna fucking pop on us those are gonna turn into something else The seven stars we call the Sidereals burn brightly in the night sky. As they watch over us for all eternity, they share with us their light. But the grandest star of them all left Arcasia to become our eternal king. Okay. <laughs> la, la, Did you take a look? Nahoon was the one who built that observatory and wrote the words on the plaque. Did you see the lyrics on the plaque? Although it looks complete, legend has it that it used to, to include a story about the king's tomb. It's lost now. Perhaps the lyrics you brought are the missing part. Can't be certain. Why don't you visit Pumpkin Village? Uh, you'll find plenty of older, more experienced bards living there who might be able to help. Okay. I assume it's going to be up this way, right? Yep. I have to chop a tree down. It's been a while. The thing I also noticed as I was playing around with my um, hideout thing that uh, a lot of this stuff, this harvesting stuff, you can make potions and battle potions and all kinds of crap. So, a little bit of harvesting as you go is not too bad of an idea. Oh, now we got those guys. Okay. Ooh, ooh, there's a boss there. Where is he? Here he comes. Yeah. 
You've come to meet my teacher? Oh. Hmm. I'm afraid this is a bad time. And why is that? Our village is plagued by a horde of bandits who call themselves the World Harvest. Because of an instigator saying that we must revisit tyranny with violence. Countless villagers have left their homes. My teacher told me I cannot return until I drive the investment from the village, but I only know how to sing. How am I supposed to drive them out? I'll do it. shall show the anger of the common people to the monarchy and build a nation that better serves us. All who are with us, come to the assembly area west of the farm. Let us crown our new king with our own hands. Hmm. <laughs> Look at them run. <laughs> hey, what's that? The World Harvest is joining forces with Sherrod's remnants? Outrageous. It's because of that we suffered. We're not going to tolerate this corrupt world harvest anymore. Please bring retribution to the harvest deputies, Downwin and Tyler, and tell Noel about it. I'm sure he'll be delighted. <laughs> right down this way. No. Up and over. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's come on everybody. Hey, everybody come together here. These guys are so underpowered. That's one of the issues with this guy is the single target on it, but it's all good. Yeah. Alright, should just be me and home down here. Father huh? asked me if I wanted to become king. Since then, many things have changed. The prince disappeared. And father sat on the throne. I prepared to succeed now, the throne after the him. Alright, now we gotta go find somebody else up here. Yeah. <laughs> 
Burn it all! Okay, there he is. All right, so get the right guy in here. That was easy. We should go up and get one last thing while well, I see it up here. Before I miss it. Really bad habit of skipping those. Then gotta run back and get it. Very big pain in the ass. What? I can't hear you. What do you want with this old man? The gentleman's hearing is not so great. You won't get through to him with words. Wait, what? You defeated the deputies of the World Harvest by the gods? Does that mean the World Harvest is done for? There's something else. I'm sure the old man would be happy to hear this, too. Here, take this. Go to the desk over there and write what you want to say to Noel. Okay. You again? Why are you still here? What are you trying to say? You defeated the World Harvest. Amazing. All right. You don't have to know all the lyrics, do you? The song describes how to get to the King's Tomb. Ah, I know the rest of the lyrics. No one can, and not just anyone can sing the song. However, even if they know the lyrics, only Linto at the Dawn Strike Hall knows the melody. Oh, my God. Here, take this to Bard Linto. You'll know what it means. Okay. Won't be able to read it. All right. Whatever. can't live like this anymore. Okay, one sec, folks. I'm gonna clean my stuff up. Okay. Got everything nice and cleaned up. Now we go see what's up. Bard uh, Lento. Huh? Who are you? My vision has grown rather dim. I can't tell who you are. Well, told you to bring me something to hear. Ha, huh? hand it over. Ah, the song for the king's tomb. Yes, I know the tune to this song. Or Noel says it's up to me to decide whether I should teach you the melody. Well, I don't see any reason why I wouldn't. Before I do, I'd like a favor. We want to hear our people being joyous right now. They're so constantly sad. Uh, okay, how are we supposed to do that? This crown is just like the iron one in that old story. Uh, the war's finally over. Is there any good news? Oh, who are you? They want me to spread His Majesty Thrain's declaration? What does it say? Oh, wow, that's great news. Leave it to me. Gather round. I shall now proclaim the words of King Thyrang. The tyranny of Regent Sherrod is over. I, Thyrain, proclaim henceforth as King of Lutera that all riches wrongfully seized shall be returned to the people of Lutera. Proud men and women of Lutera, wicked deceivers like Sherrit shall never be tolerated in this kingdom again. May the honor and pride of Lutera live on forever. So proclaims King Thyrain. Three cheers for our new king. I'll second that. <laughs> How wonderful. Okay. I'm pleased. Yep, that's nice. Teach me the song. <laughs> Impressive. Very impressive. Uh, everyone's truly delighted. Time to keep my end of the bargain. I'll teach you the tune as promised. Remember, though, that you have to sing the song at a certain location. The song is named after a certain flower. The language of that flower is worship and waiting. 
say there's no better praise for a knight than gifting this flower. What do you think the flower and song are called? I think you know the answer. Go visit where the these flowers bloom. There you will meet the last bard who will lead you to the king's tomb. What? Oh, the... Okay. So what we'll do... We'll head on over here. And we will hit that... In the next episode, we'll talk to that dude. Because hopefully this is going to be a giant dungeon. I'm really hoping. So keep your heads down. Your health potions up. And I'll see you again real damn soon.